Um, hello everyone, in this video I will show you how to build Gitbox with RStudio. Okay, so remember last time we have already um, set up our new um, textbook folder. Let's review some of the commands. So after you um, include the R Gitbook library, you can create a new book with the new gitbook function and then um, you will have a, a folder like test books something like this and you will have the summary file and the readme file and some other files um, so in addition after you apply the init gitbooks function um, you actually get some R markdown file uh, ready to be added um, in some sections like section 1 and section 2. So let's first uh, take a look at the readme file and summary files before we move on to the building process. Okay, so for the readme file, um, include um, the book titles author names and the introduction of the books so you can actually replace the um, the content with whatever you want um, in the readme file so for the summary file as you can see here uh, it is the um, structure of the git books um, in each um, section or subsection there will be the links to the um, markdown file Okay, so uh, after you know the structure of this um, this git book, we are ready to edit each of the R markdown files in each folder. For example, last time I have already created um, some code code in the example one files in the section one um, folder. So I just add uh, some simple um, content add some uh, content and then um, save this file okay now we move on to the building process um, so suppose we are done with our editing and then um, the next thing we need to do is to build our markdown so let's copy and run this function um, as you can see here there, there, there are some output um, files for the markdown uh, for the markdown files um, after that um, I use another function build git books um, run it and it says our markdown file successfully built um, now I think we are done with our uh, git book um, notice that we got a um, underscore book folder with contents all the um, result of our git book um, you can directly click this index.html function to uh, take a look at your gitbook. Um, also, you can use this open gitbook function to open that, which give, gives you the same result. So yeah, um, let's take a look at our R markdown file. I think, uh, as you can see from the result, uh, the R markdown perfectly um, integrated with the uh, gitbook that is actually what I want here so um, everything works fine up to now and then I can build a um, gitbooks with R markdown locally um, in the next video I will show you how to publish this um, gitbook thank you for watching